Hi, this is Francisco Bujan from VitaCoaching.com and we are talking about breakups for men. The topic for this video is how to step out of the breakup zone fast. There is only one thing that you need to do when you break up. If you want to step out of, uh, of this breakup zone very fast, it is to let go of the past and focus on the future. There is another thing that you have to do, which is very important as well, it is to limit the impact of your breakup on the rest of your life. You need to protect three key areas in your life. And these ones are your health, the second one is your social life, and the third one is your career, your business, your job, whatever you are doing for a living. When you break up, very often, this breakup tends to impact on the other, these other areas of your life. You start sleeping less well, uh, you let go of training, you uh, eat not so healthy, etc. So eventually you let go of being in good shape and you end up in a place which is not very nice. So when you go training, you know, you use energy, you activate your body, this already gives you a boost and it's a massive empowering force to gain back your power very fast. Okay, stay on track physically. The second one that I talked about is social life. You need to activate your social life. You need to uh, um, reconnect with friends or activate, uh, respond to invitations, all this. Don't hide at home. Don't isolate yourself. Just go out as much as you can. And I don't mean partying until 5 in the morning totally drunk. That's not the thing to do. You want to stay in charge of your life, right? You want to, to, to keep your mind uh, focus, but at the same time it's very important to interact with people as much as you can, your friends or eventually new fresh dates. And this is going to give you a boost, a massive boost. And um, the third one was your professional life, okay? If you are employed somewhere, the last thing you want is to lose your job at the same time, you have to be focused when you go to work. So keep work and personal issues separate. This is a very important guideline. If you are at work, don't talk about your divorce or breakup with your friends or team or the context where you work. You want to keep work and personal life separate. If you need to talk about what's going on with your divorce or breakup and you really want to share what's happening, hire a professional, call me, give a, a call to a friend, a good friend, somebody you trust, and go for a drink, talk about it within a limited context. But try, you know, when you're in a social situation and you meet a new girl, don't mention, don't mention your ex, don't talk about it with your friends. If a friend comes to you and asks you, uh, so how is it going with the divorce or breakup, you can say, you know what, why don't we talk about, it, about something else today because I've been talking about that a lot and right now I want to clear my mind. And that's fine, you know, you have to put it aside and kind of try to limit it to its real size. If you let it expand, then of course it's going to take all the place in your mind, all the, take in your, all, all the place in your life. So keep it to its real size. You know, you limit that to really what it is. It is an emotional challenge that you can really kind of oversee and handle, uh, you know, one step at a time. But don't let it expand to other areas, uh, other areas of your life. So this is one or the key, stra of, uh, the key strategies that you have to apply to uh, get your power back fast and, and uh, focus on, um, on the future. Okay, the next thing to realize, which is also very important, it is that the reason why guys tend to stay stacked in the breakup zone for longer than needed is because they are extremely focused on the past. What they are trying to do is simply recall the past emotions, trying to hold on what happened in the past rather than focusing on the future. So what you can do is really shift perspective. If you are looking at the past, you can slowly first focus on the present and then start looking into the future. Once you focus on the future, you realize that most of the times, what's wrong? You know, you have all the possibilities open in front of you. You can start dating again, you are free, you have space in your life. It's really a time for new beginnings. And maybe this breakup might be the best thing that happened to you because there is all this space open. It's time to think about what is coming next. So when you want to get out of the breakup zone fast, what you have to do is again shift from looking into the past to look into the present and the future. Because these are the doors which are really open. And whatever new happens in your life, it's going to come from the future. This is where the opportunities are. They are in the future, not in the past. The past has already been experienced. What you had to learn from your past, you already did, right? Now it's time to look into the future and realize, hey, there is a world of possibilities, a world of opportunities, and let's go focus on that. Okay, I hope this makes sense. You take care.
and have a great day. Bye-bye.